the Bengals weren't able to get anything out of their last drive and were forced to punt as they take the field here. Do you think they are going to vary their approach, Phil? Well, I hope so. I think they will. They, they got a lot of information out there in that short drive, Jim, and you did that by showing different formations and plays. You saw how the defense reacted to it. Now you counter-react and see if you can get some positive plays. I'm sure they're tired of being in the three and out business. Well, that's a bad business to be in. I know I get in a lot of bad businesses. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Second and ten. Sanu makes the grab. Tackled down at the 28-yard line. That's his first reception today. The Bengals that time they can't get big yards, but the throw and catch picks up a few, and his third down's much easier with this situation. The defensive line, they're shifting. They're getting into a spread look. I think they think this is going to be a pass. And he's going to be dropped for the sack. That's going to bring up fourth down after just a three-play series. They've come out of the blocks fairly sluggishly. And this defense has taken full advantage, Bill. Yeah, the offense having a tough time. They did not have a good series that time. And the defense, you're right, took advantage of a sluggish offense and got off the field. Jenkins has got it on the return. And a run back of about 16. Jenkins is such a great athlete. You've got to find ways to get the football to him. Here's another way. The Buccaneers. Quarters formation here for the defense. First down at the 41. Second down now. To the ground. The tackle. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. Third down. The Buccaneers' defense now is going to go nickel. Jim, look at that. The defensive line all shifting down inside. They're expecting a run right up the middle. Another third down stop right there and into the second quarter of play now. We really haven't seen this offense on track quite yet. Yeah, let's give all the credit to the defense. I like how they're playing on the defensive side. They're, the defensive coordinator is making good calls, and they are making it happen. offense coming back onto the field here desperately trying to avoid a repeat of their last drive when they had the quick three and out I'll tell you what if they go three and out again you know what's going to happen those defensive players are going to be looking at them as they come off the field you put this back out there already so it's important to get a drive give your defense a little rest second down following the run when you run the football like this and you show toughness there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. And we've reached the two-minute warning. Welcome back, and we're coming out of the two-minute warning. The Bengals come to the line, and they put their receivers in a bunch formation. Third and four. A.J. Green, and he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Nice job that time by the defense, knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. Jenkins is going to look for space now. A run back of about 17. The Buccaneers know there's three parts to every football game. Offense, deep. The Buccaneers. Yeah. 
For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. The Bengals will take the snap from the 25. Picks up about five. The Bengals signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Incompletion here as he was looking over the middle. The defense stops the clock. They face third down after the incomplete pass. Dalton from the shotgun. Dalton delivers it to Bernard. The ball is fumbled. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Jim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. First down at the 49. Intercepted. Tackles made. The first half is complete. Larry Ridley ready to take things over back in the start. Welcome back. First down at the 20. Ball is out. And the recovery is made by the defense. Dalton is the one who is down and will step aside for just a moment. Officials, play stop play now. Review. They want to take another look at that last play. Was the knee down, Phil, or was it a fumble first? Well, I think what we need to do here, let's stop it when the knee hits the ground. And once we stop it, let's look at the football. Does he have possession of it completely at that time? If he does, then it's going to be down. The runner will be down before the After fumble occur. The, play, the ruling on the field is reversed. Well, it was called one way on the field. It was a booth review, and the call was overturned. After nearly turning it over, it's second down. doesn't appear this defense is going to be any less superior in the second half than they were in the first. Well, Jim, they have everything. They got a good defensive line, good linebackers, good secondary, and an aggressive coach. What's that add up to? A really outstanding defense. I think the coach on the sidelines, he's going to be happy with every first down because he knows that's more time off the clock. When you're up like this, multiple scores in the second half, every first down just puts the odds in your favor of winning this game. That defensive front looks impenetrable here on the goal line. Hawks all over that offense and brings him down. What a job by the defense down on the goal line. They were playing run all the way. It was a run. They got the penetration, and they tackled the runner for a loss. Second and goal from the two-yard line. Breaks the plane, and it's a touchdown. Obviously, they're not content to just sit on the lead. They're putting the hammer down here early in the third quarter. Oh, yeah. Listen, this is fun time, man. Keep padding those stats. It's like if you get two home... The Bengals are set to take the field again on offense after a crazy sequence that didn't go their way. That turnover led to turnover points. And now let's see if the offense can get that back, Phil. Yeah, listen, I know they're going to be motivated because after they turned the football over last time, the coaches took them to the sideline and just gave them heck. That's for sure. That's a good way of seeing it. So motivation, can't make those kind of mistakes. You've got to go out there and be much better. Players from both sides made an appeal, but the referees say it's on the defense. 
Let's go. Look at those linebackers shifting around, trying to confuse the quarterback. And it's A.J. who hauls it in. All you can do is your job, and that was a good job by the offense, picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. Hey, don't worry about the score right now. Just find ways to execute plays and get down there and score a touchdown. First down here. Get ready. Hills handed the football. Sherman's in on the tackle. The Buccaneers guessed right on the defensive side that time. They thought it was going to be a run play. They were all over it, and they got it in the backfield and made the tackle. Second and 11. The surveys. The defense gets the sack. Well, every defense is looking for somebody to sack the quarterback. And that time, the speed of the defensive end gets around the tackle and gets the sack. The Bengals will set up. The 44 is the first down line. The Bengals from the 22. And incomplete. What a hit that time. We still have more than a quarter to play here, Phil, but this defense shows no signs of wearing down. I think we're surprised by this, really. We didn't expect them to just dominate all day long, and so far, it has been total domination. is a tough job and it's about judgment at that time that was poor judgment by the return to the Buccaneers Let's go. first down at the 20 he takes it on the counter gets about four yards that time Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stopped him for a short game. And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. A.J. Green with the catch. Well, you're really in a tough spot, but that is a good job picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. All you can do, just keep picking up those first downs. You hope it leads you to a score, and then you play the game from there. First down at the 35. Throws the pass. Tried to find his target over the middle, but that pass goes incomplete. That was an incomplete pass that time against cover two, the two deep safeties, and you really want to throw the football down the middle or deep down the sidelines. That time the quarterback didn't do that. That's why it was incomplete. And give that reception to A.J. Green. The fourth quarter about to get underway, and there's not much left to do in this one other than to run out the clock. Yeah, that's what you hope to do on the side. When you're winning a game like this, you want to run the clock out 
And you know what, Jim? On the other side, they want that clock to run, too, because they're just trying to find a way to get out of this game. Something we've seen time and time again, Phil, this offense just looking... Defensive line now shifting to a spread look. They're going to try to pressure the quarterback on this play. Looking middle that time, and it's incomplete. The Bengals have a tough road ahead of them. Dalton's been trying to battle through some tough spots, but he's been up and down today. That's what you have to do as a quarterback. You said the appropriate word, battle. The quarterback, keep battling, stay with it, and hope you can turn things around. Second down and 10. Over the middle and incomplete that time. We've got a player down, so we'll step aside and be back in just a moment. It's third down coming up. Can't find a mark, and this is going to bring up fourth down. Short series this time for the off. It has. from the 22. McCoy takes down the quarterback. The Bengals are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. With about 30 seconds left, it's second down. The defensive line saw something the offense is doing. Look at them all shifting to the right. Looking across the middle, can't find the target on the pass underneath. Well, the most common thing that most offensive coordinators do in the NFL on third and long situations, they're going to call a play where they probably don't think they're going to pick up the first down, but they're looking for field position. Tyler Eifert has the grab. The Bengals face fourth down, but want to take a timeout before they snap the football. That timeout might be very useful. Can't sugarcoat this one, partner. This one-sided affair was just nothing but a blowout. Yeah, there are a lot of words that come to mind. I can't see him on TV, that's for sure. But it was one big kicking. And they just lost every phase. They got beat physically. The NFL is still about who's the most physical team.